Hey Cyclone Center classifiers, my name is Kelly. I am a classifier and contributor for Cyclone Center as well as a student at the University of North Carolina at Asheville. And today, in my opinion, we are going to be classifying one of the most fun storms to classify on Cyclone Center and one of the easiest to recognize as well, and that is the eye storm. So first things first, you want to choose a storm image that appears stronger. Again, a few key things to look for, and that's colder cloud tops. That's so going to be that those blue colors. Darker blue is the coldest. That lighter blue, as you can see in these pic images that we have, are cold clouds. And then the organization of the clouds, so the spiral banding of both of these storm images. And also, if there is an eye on the storm image, that also is indicating that it is a stronger storm. So with those three things, the storm on the right is going to be the stronger storm image. So next, we're going to want to pick the cyclone type, then choose its closest match. Now, in this case, it's pretty obvious that we have an eye storm because of the eye, but if you are lost or unsure, you can scroll down to the bottom of the page, and there is a cyclone field guide, so it'll help you figure out which storm image you are looking at. So, like I said, eye storm, easiest storm to spot in the most powerful, powerful tropical cyclones. So, we are going to choose eye storm. Then we have to pick the storm image that most closely resembles the storm image we are trying to classify. So in this case, I'm going to go with the third storm image in being the closest to our storm image. So next we have to pick the center of the storm, then pick the size closest to the eye edge. And again, if you are confused on how to find the center of the storm, there is a guide that will help you. So you want to identify the eye in the center of the storm. So you're looking for a very warm area near the center of the storm surrounded by a ring of very cold clouds. So finding the center of the storm is super easy for an eye storm because it's just the center of the eye. So we're going to click on the center of the eye and then pick the size that's closest to its match. In this case, it's going to be the third circle in. So next, which colors completely surround the eye? In our case, with this storm, the light blue color completely is surrounding the eye. The teal color doesn't completely surround it all the way. Next, we're going to use a measuring tool to help see which colors completely surround the eye that are at least half a degree thick. So looking at this storm, we are going to go with, again, the light blue color. Now we have to choose an image that matches the banding feature. Again, if you're lost, there is a guide below to help you determine how far the band wraps around the storm. And I'm going to go about halfway. In there you have it. You have just classified an eye storm on Cyclone Center. Since eye storms are one of the coolest tropical cyclones to look at, you could share this image on Facebook or on your Twitter page, or you could discuss it on our talk page here on Cyclone Center. You could favorite the storm to look at the image later, or scroll down to learn more about the storm. In our case, we just classified an image from Gert. So you could keep on classifying, which is what I'm going to do because I love eye storms. So happy classifying and enjoy your time on Cyclone Center.